In this video, we'll discuss and introduce yield management, a key component and relatively new feature of ResNexus. Companies who effectively implement yield management strategies report an increase in revenue of 3 to 11 percent and higher. In many industries, this doubles their profit. How can you use yield management to increase your revenue? We'll talk about that in just a minute. But first, let's discuss yield. Yield is your income, minus expenses or your profit margin. For example, if you're spending the same amount and bringing in more money on a per customer basis, this would cause an increase in your yield. Since yield management relies so much on the interaction between supply and demand, let's take a quick look at these two laws. Let's discuss the law of demand. It works like this. Demand decreases as cost increases. The higher the price of an item, the less people will demand it. Therefore, the less quantity is needed. Think private jets. Not too many people are buying private jets because of the high price. However, if the price is lower, people can buy the item without breaking the bank. Think cupcakes. As consumer demand increases, higher quantities are needed. Now let's talk about the law of supply. This law shows how sellers respond to price. Supply increases as price increases. When an item sells at a low price, sellers aren't motivated to sell a lot of those items, so quantities stay low. If the price of an item is high and people are in the mode of buying that item, sellers want to supply that item to earn more money, so they produce higher quantities. A great example of this is smartphones. During their initial production, Quantities of smartphones were limited because sellers didn't know how the market would respond to the price. Quantities quickly increased once sellers realized the market would support the higher prices. For customers, when goods get expensive, demand drops. But for sellers, when goods sell at a high price, supply rises. You can see then that the relationship between price and quantity is opposite for customers and sellers. This point here, where the two graphs intersect, is reached when supply and demand are equally matched. This is when the economy is at what we call equilibrium. When this happens, everything is operating at maximum efficiency because there are customers for all the goods and goods for all the customers. Now let's see what happens to supply and demand in the real world and how they interact with each other. You have rooms to sell and you want customers to fill those rooms. So you've got to find the price point that keeps demand strong, but not so strong that supply suffers. It's a total balancing act to stay as close to equilibrium as possible. So this is the area you want to stay in. We'll call it the maximum revenue zone. Why is it important to stay in this zone? Let's see what happens when supply and demand go out of whack. If you set your prices too low, you'll have excess demand. Remember, that's where customers are lined up wanting what you have to offer but you're running low on inventory. Think of Thanksgiving. Have you ever been out shopping on Black Friday? If so, then you know exactly what I'm talking about. Not to mention, you're killing your profit margins when your prices are too low. On the flip side, if you set your prices too high, you'll definitely have inventory available, but your customers are nowhere to be found. It's kind of like being at the movies when you dread spending that $15 on popcorn and a drink. When you're not in balance, you're either overcharging or undercharging. So your ability to vary your price plays a very powerful role in managing your business's supply and demand. This is yield management. It's being in the zone of supply and demand. You want to get the highest price per customer you can while still keeping a high number of customers. It's complete business efficiency. But here's where it gets tricky. Businesses are constantly moving in and out of the zone in response to market changes in supply and demand. Imagine your yield management strategy automatically taking into account market factors such as industry trends, local demand, competition, weather, time of year or short notice bookings. Business owners who use yield management effectively have been surprised to find that offering discounts for certain things like booking reservations during the off season or well in advance and charging more during peak seasons or short notice bookings allowed them to keep their standard rate the same but still increase profits and bring in new customers. That's why ResNexus embedded yield management right inside its software. What's the benefit you ask? ResNexus keeps you in the zone automatically. In this dynamic marketplace, if you set your price and leave it, you're missing out on revenue opportunities. 
Yield management with ResNexus is controlling your inventory, helping you sell it at the right time to the right customer at just the right price. Supply and demand can be a tough principle to comprehend. It might take re-watching this video a couple of times to really understand it, so we invite you to do that. We'd like to thank you for taking a few minutes to become more acquainted with yield management. Please accept our open invitation to speak directly with one of our red carpet service professionals to find out more about the professional edition of ResNexus and how you can implement your very own yield management strategies by watching the additional video links below. Give us a call today at 385-218-2637. Again, that's 385-218-2637. We look forward to speaking with you soon.